It's integrated math three practice test for ten ready or TCAP. Question number eight, we're in subpart one, which means no calculator. Shanika is making a decorative tablecloth for her small circular table. The table has a radius of 40 centimeters and a height of 60 centimeters. She wants the tablecloth to hang at even 10 centimeters above the ground. So the good news is the program that I use to uh, write things has a uh, program that will allow me to not have to draw these because I'm terrible at drawing anything. Um, I'm working on it. It's not like I think of, I'm somehow never going to do it. I just don't know. So she has her table and her table has a 40 centimeter oh. see I can't even draw a straight radius uh, radius just pretend it's a straight radius it's not and then she has her table here it probably has some sort of bottom like this on it and from the ground it's 60 centimeters so it's gonna have to hang over on each side if she wants to be 10 centimeters from the ground 50 so I'm going to knock that off just a little bit and change this because you don't want the tablecloth touching the ground most of the time unless you hide stuff under there or I guess if you have gross feet and you don't want to show anybody but you don't want to wear shoes I don't know whatever it's your, it's your life live it how you want um, so I've got all that set up so what I need is to have a much bigger tablecloth and just covering the top because then it's just like that plastic stuff that you use at diners. Let's see if I can move this around. There we go. It's trying to give you some feel of what this is going to look like. It also needs to be much bigger. So you only get to see a little bit of it. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, so now that we have this, we have the 40 centimeters as the radius, and then we have this extended part out, which again, it was, we want to hang 50 centimeters off the uh, table, so I should have changed drawing color to have that whole thing there. It's like I'm not trying to do a unified ex explanation or anything. So now I have this, the 40 and the 50, so I'm going to combine those together and get a final answer of a radius of 90 centimeters. So my answer is A. Um, 110 centimeters, I think that's just adding all the numbers together. And this person says that they need a rectangular piece of cloth, but she wants it to hang evenly at 10 centimeters. The only way that you can hang evenly is to have the same shape as the top of the table. So if the top of the table is a rectangle and you want it to hang uh, evenly, then you can use a rectangular piece of cloth. If you have a circular um, table and you put a rectangle on it, one side's going to be really long and one side's going to be short. Just try it out yourself if you don't believe me. But really, the idea that you have the radius here and then the extension, the only part that I would think would be a big deal, and they didn't even put an answer in that case, it's just to have the 60 plus 90. Uh, instead, they did the add all the numbers thing. So this wasn't a super difficult question as long as you can visualize what it is. So if you have this type of question on the actual 10 ready test, I mean, the worst, I mean, nobody's going to care what you draw. So it might be helpful just to draw it if you can't see it. Uh, that way to get some feel of what that whole thing looks like and then think about it in your mind. Like, oh, okay, that's what the tablecloth will look like. And if it's going to be even, it's got to be the same shape. So that's all the parts that you need. Done.